Hey, hey, pearly bead friends. So, I just came to the realization that you can use a heat gun on pearly wow. beads. I've had a broken Pikachu, and I just used this heat gun to repair him. So, I have this broken Stranger Things one, and we're going to see if we can repair it also. So, this is just like an average heat gun. I got it for Shrinky Dinks for Rinjoli. We're going to see what it can do. And see it's one minute. It's starting to melt. And I'm just pushing it back on top of each other. It's melting a little too much now. Now it's really hot. Oh wow, I didn't even stick to the table. I stopped because I thought it was melting the table, but it comes right up. And try to push it down a little bit. It's very hot. And I need a little more. This is just my second test run. So it seems to be holding together really well. So I'm gonna flip it over and do the back. Now this pearl bead is a little rough in general. It was one of the first large ones that I made. So my ironing was not really on point. It was the first one I fused together as two pieces also. So it's still a little cracked over here. It's not that you can see it, but I just wanna make sure it's actually gonna hold. This is one of my personal pieces, so. So now I'm just gonna let that fuse together as it hardens. It is pretty hot, but. I've been doing beads for a long time, so I'm pretty used to it. I'm very curious to see if this will work on small beads or beads on pegboards. Um, I'll be experimenting later on. <clears throat> also, if you guys have any tips on how to repair this bead, on how to make it a little flatter, I'm afraid to iron it again. But I tried to put it under heavy books and it's just not the same. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this tip. And if you um, got a bead that needs to be repaired, I suggest you give a. I suggest if you have a bead that needs repaired, you give a heat gun a try.